My dad would collect any university sweater he could get and would wear them a lot. He didn't even finish high school, but he knew wearing that kind of clothing gave him a level of acceptability, I think, that he was looking for. He was from East LA, but would come to drop me off at school, which was in a context where he wasn't maybe as welcomed. When you're in that situation, you learn how to code switch, what subjects to speak about, what ways to dress. And so in my paintings, I kind of meditate on these ideas in this overlapping, sometimes disharmonious situation. I know. In my work, I play with perception a lot. The viewer becomes an active participant. Depending on someone's associations with different type styles, specific words, who they think the figures in these paintings are, the message changes. The rear view mirror stands in for the idea of double consciousness. Seeing yourself from a third party view, always evaluating. Every artist paints from their own personal reference, but I think depending on what light you show things in, it will change your perception of them. Even though I'm painting, it's still a very collage kind of process. Looking at old family photos and pulling out different iconography that I can work with. I like being able to abstract it and maybe have more of this sometimes more feminine palette, kind of technicolors that aren't really um, lifelike. I paint the male figures from my family. Most of them have passed and they're no longer with us. It's a way of remembrance, but also all male figures kind of stand in proxy for my dad. He always did carry the sense of like wanting to be acknowledged or like do something more. I think that he would enjoy this because it's showing him in a different light. All of the male figures in my paintings, they also in a way stand in for me. A lot of my work is about like remixing and reimagining, reframing these symbols and words and font styles and showing how it influences who you think the person is in these paintings, what kind of life you suspect that they have. <laughs>